lot of ground to cover. True, but unlike your boy Asav, we've got an advantage. The three symbols. Let's have a look at the map. Okay, let's see. We are right about here. I can mark it up as we go. Check out that tower. Bet you could get the lay of the land from the top. Maybe. <laughs> okay. I'll keep an eye out for a sob. Perfect. Not that I'm too worried about him, though. You should be. We won't have the advantage of surprise again. Don't think he was expecting much from you. Wait. Was that a compliment? That, that sounded like a compliment. His guys are idiots, but a solvice. We just need to stay the hell away from them. Never understood the appeal of people like Saab. Easy. He finds men who are weak and offers them power. Gives them purpose. Purpose? Sounds more like bullshit to me. Where are you going? Up I really way. want to, but uh, someone should keep watch for us off forces. Good call. Easy does it. All right. So far, so good. Here's our three symbols. Well, that took less time than I expected. Aimed right at those Hoysala ruins. It's an old fortress, tucked into the mountainside. I'll just mark that on the map with an axe. Let's see what's behind the bow door. Another old fortress, sitting smack dab in the middle of the lake bed. I'll jot a bow on the map in that spot. Let's see what's behind the trident door. And another old fortress, just beyond those waterfalls. Trident mark on the map for you. Last one. Huh. Wonder what that could be. For future reference. button before climbing up. Well, was it worth a climb? And then some. Found the three symbols. Really? Yep. Each one was pointing towards a different fortress. Those will be the best places to look. Perfect. How'd you get tangled up with the Sav anyway? Purpose? Rather not go into it. You certainly seem to have a thing for you. Don't remind me. Proved useful at the time, but... Yeah. Uh, do tell. Rather not. Maybe over drinks? Not enough alcohol in the world. Right, you're the military expert. What's the Saab's strategy here? He spread out his men, hoping to stop us in our treks. Not what I would do. So what would you do if you were a Saab? 
Besides, lose the beard. Hang back. Let you do the heavy lifting, then swoop in and grab up the task once you've done all the hard work. Deviant. Oh, over there, in that cliff wall. See that archway? Looks intact. You coming with? I feel like stretching my legs. Rightio. <clears throat> what is this place? You got me. <laughs> well, will you look at that? Monkeys. You seem excited. I like monkeys. What have we here? Let's see. Is it just me, or does that look like a map? Looks like our map. Oh. I'll just jot that down. Interesting. Some kind of Hoysala token. What about the symbols up there? There's a slot. Just the right size for a token. Let's give it a whirl. It filled one of the spots on the map. Yeah. Wonder what happens if we find them all. Look at that bracelet. It must have belonged to one of their queens. Looks like there's something in the structure there. Yeah, monkeys. Besides monkeys. Hey, no hitchhikers. <coughs> oh, you're no fun. What, you want them shitting all over the seat? <coughs> Looks safe. Smells safe. Let's go. All right. And we were talking about... Oh, right. Devious. Practical. Mitigates a lot of risks. Lucky you're on my team. Yeah, you are. I'm a little surprised Assault's not doing the same thing. Maybe his expert knows more than we think. Right. All the more reason to wrap this up quickly, then. Look there. One of Assault's trucks. Looks clear out here. Interesting circular motif, like the disc. Hey, look. Shiva's axe. Matches the symbol in the tower. <coughs> Shiva. It was the god of destruction, right? <laughs> yes. But maybe not the way you're thinking. They're not blowing things up. Definitely not. Okay. Going, going. Ah! Let's get inside. What do you suppose this place was? Hard to say. A fortress? Not the right layout for a temple. Ah. Salah versus the tiger. Salah won, actually. He was protecting his guru and killed the animal in one blow. It's where the name Hoi Salah comes from. Hoi, meaning strike, in their language. No, 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 no! no! <coughs> you all right, Fraser? <coughs> yep, fine. Come on down.
They've left their climbing gear. They should come in handy. Correction. Our climbing gear. Yeah. Oh my. What the hell is this? Okay, let's see what this does. That statue moved. Well, I'll be going to hell. That's elaborate. Oh shit. Statue moved again. Goodness sake. Three statues with two different symbols now. Star and rings. You're all my Salah sons, but I like your description better. Oh, turns out getting walloped by an axe hurts a little. Would you like to give it a shot? I'm good, thanks. Nearly there. Right. 
figured we had one more to go. Did you hear that? Everything always comes in three. We'll see. Well, looky here. What are you willing to bet? Told you it's some kind of key. Gold star for you. Now let's see what it does. What is it? Ancient horse law jigsaw puzzle? Of course. I'm making an axe. Nice to see you, Shiva. Now what? Now I guess we turn this crank and see what happens next. You think it's safe? You know that... Treasure hunting is not a good gig for the risk of us, right? Neither is being a mercenary. Difference is when I pull the pin on a grenade, I know what's going to happen next. My way's much more fun. <laughs> Did you hear that? You feel that? Look at that. Holy hell. There's a massive relief carved into the side of that mountain. And you were worried that we were going to turn that crank and die. Guess it's good I've got an archaeologist's daughter with me. It must have been fun growing up, eh? It had its moments. I learnt a lot. Hoysalar Empire was kind of his thing. Took up a lot of his time, though. Me, if I go digging for treasure, I better make a buck or two. Oh, sure. I don't take big risks without a good payday. I imagine so. Like running an army, huh? That's a big responsibility. Second nature. It's my father's company. He retired, I took over. Family business? Hmm. Made a real mess of it. But you should know. Heard you and those Drake brothers are close. Yeah, well, it's a conversation for another time. So, where to next? There's the fort marked with a bow in the lake bed, and that fort sporting the trident above the waterfalls. I suppose I should have asked about the Drakes before I took the job. Not much to tell. I know Nate pretty well, Sam less so. He seemed to just appear out of thin air. Let's head back to the car. Gotta love a shortcut. <laughs> Glad we don't have to go back to where we came. I would have made you dodge the axes. and waterfalls. 
Hey, just so you know, Nathan Drake is no longer in the picture. You don't have to worry about him. I had my concerns. Why do you accept my offer? I'm not one to look a gift horse in the mouth, especially with everyone wanting to see me fall. I hear that. Sorry, I need a moment. Hmm, this symbol. Not one of the three we're looking for, but it matches the one in that shrine we visited. Oh, really building up my calluses this trip. Hmm. Good thing I packed my thinking cap. Similar to that lock mechanism I saw earlier, but a bit more involved. on the fun. Another crest of a Hoysala king. Someone went to a lot of trouble to hide this. Found anything? Found another token. As so long as we visit the other two forts, I'm good. What? Pick it back up? Yeah. So, anyway, there's a plus side to people wanting to see you fail. Oh, there's a plus side? Oh, when people have low expectations, it's much easier to take them by surprise. As far as I'm concerned, this business is tough enough on your own. You have to take any advantage you can. You always worked alone? Mostly. How old were you when you started? Young. Learned quickly enough I needed to let people think they were getting their way, and then I could get the upper hand. Too subtle for me. I always preferred the direct approach. Yeah, whatever works, I say. 
It's compromised. Look up there. Parashurama's bow. Spotted this on the tower, too. So, Parashurama. 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 Hey. Right. Who was he again? Okay. Six avatar of the god Vishnu. A fearsome warrior. Right. Still wrapping my head around it all. Here we go. Hey, I'll take care of this one. Okay. There. Shithole, finally. I was starting to think the boss was. It's Fraser! That's it. We're clear. Probably a lure to the others. Can't be helped. Come on. Clear. Won't be the last of them. There's a big truck parked out front. We'll keep our eyes open. We'd better. We'd walk right off a cliff. You do have a sense of humor. <sighs> Would have preferred a head start over assault. Not much we can do. Besides, doesn't matter who starts, only who finishes. See that? Looks like another faucet. Let's find a way up. How are you so relaxed? Didn't you hear those gunshots? I did. You worry too much. Our brothers are trained by assassins. I'm keeping my safety off, just in case. Mine was never on.
Are we clear? We're clear. Good. Good to be clear. Let's press on. Just what I was going to say. <laughs> Not gate. Perfect. That should do it. Across at least. Sorry. I'm sure you can find your way over here. Oh, definitely. Figured you'd want to take the easy way over. <laughs> Beg your pardon? Doing all right? I'm fine. Just don't get started without me. Okay, guess this isn't the way in. Oh, there you are, having fun. Just like the monkey bars in primary school. I'd say this looks safer than the playground at my school. You're impressed. I'm tired. Let's get this done. All right. I'm guessing it'll be a bow this time. Good guess. Trickier.
look at that. Barasharama. Right. Let's turn the water on. Well, well. What's to say it's not different this time? What if it's fire or something? You're messing with me. I'm totally messing with you. Here we go. Mm -hmm. I'm a little disappointed it wasn't fire. Another waterfall. Yeah. It's two out of three now. Marcelo went to an absurd amount of trouble to hide the tusk. Well, the tusk was the symbol of Hoysala dominance, representing their wealth and their might. A nice trophy for the Persians. Yeah. My dad always thought that the tusk was something even greater, though. What? Your dad was after the tusk? Well, my dad was obsessed with it. He spent every day and night researching it. All our money wasted on fruitless expeditions. Heard that one before. Ugh. So what came of it? I don't know. <laughs> well, he sent me and my mum away. He said it was no longer safe. <sighs> and off to Australia we went. <laughs> and now here I stand on the outskirts of Halibadu. That's pretty funny. And the last fort's nestled above the falls. The one with the trident. The Easter accent makes sense now. Yeah. Fraser's not exactly an Indian surname either. It was my mum's. Let's find a way to get back down to the car. Sounds good. This is open now. Just the one by the falls left. Sounds like a plan. Makes more sense why it solves after the tusk now. Figured he just wanted the money, like us. He'll use it to rally people to his cause, wavered in the government's face. Just like all the others. This has happened before? Oh yeah. Ever since the young king lost to the Persians. Everyone's wanted to lay claim. <laughs> but careful, that place is crawling with rebels. Where were we? We were talking about fighting over the tusk. Everyone's wanted to lay claim to it, to this land. Mira thought we were just going on a treasure hunt. We are. Let men like Asav fight over it. It's none of our concern. Fighting wars was my concern for a time. Good point. But you did it for the cash. Usually. What about when you worked for Asav? <laughs> Definitely a cash fair. Hardly worth the trouble. Ouch. Why do it then? Needed to establish my rep, eh? Figured I'd start with the worst of the bunch. Nowhere to go but up after that. Fraser, hold up. We've got rebels up ahead. All finished. The turret is set up. 
manual. What took you so long? Couldn't find the manual. Manual? This is exactly what I've been saying. This gear's outdated. We need real weapons if we're supposed to be a proper army. Be grateful for what we do have. Isn't Asab always saying that the poor shouldn't be grateful? Shit! <laughs> Another one. Another token for my collection. After all that, you found anything? Found another token. Out here. Is this your first visit to India? Yeah. Not a lot of perks in this line of work, but travel is definitely one of them. Where have you been? Uh, where haven't I been? Whichever question works for you. Well, I haven't been to the States. Really? Yeah, well, the stuff I'm looking for is usually old, right? The US was only founded a couple of hundred years ago. True. What about you? Where do you want to go? Iceland. Nice choice. Beautiful, man. Well, it's quiet. I'm spoiled. And I want to see those northern lights. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's on the bucket list, too. With that. Careful. The Sov's men might be around. Check it out. It's Ganesh's trident. Man. Glad I climbed that tower, eh? Ganesh. Remover of obstacles. Is the gate secure? Not I've yet. Back. Waiting on Cobra just keep 8. Just quiet as long as we can. What the? Shit. Saw something. What the? Have them right here! Let's see us! Should not have crossed! 
That's a lot of them. You all right? Fine. Just thinking of all the ways that could have gone better. See, I'm thinking about how it could have gone worse. Much more positive outlook, sort of. Hmm. Okay, that's not it. No, this. What's the trick here? What? Looked like a button. Yeah, I just wanted you to have a go at something. What's this? That's a good sound. One of the spokes on the wheel just turned around. Huh. The locks are retracting when I turn the wheels. So then there's probably five in total. Four to go then. That's two. Hey, here's another. I'll get it. Only one left. Last but not least. That should do it. Okay. Back to the big wheel thing. Big wheel thing? Whatever the archaeological term for it is. Mm, big wheel thing works. Hey. You did it. Goddamn 
Right on. Dead. Oh, come on. Looks like we're going under. Radio. <laughs> There's our closet. One trident coming up. Oh, what the hell? That's not fair. Ganesh? Hello, sir. Come on, let's get this over and done with. Yep. Whoa! Shit! See? I told you it was dangerous. You hurt. Just my dignity. Here we go. Let there be water. Now that's three. You know, you're pretty good at this whole treasure hunting thing. I'm a quick study. Mm. One question, though. I reckon that you could pretty much do anything you want. Why are you so keen to get Shoreline back? Seriously? Mm. My partner tends my own men against me. My lieutenant makes off with a bounty. Nathan and Samuel Drake get off scot-free and you're asking why I want Shoreline back. Yeah. I was on my watch. I lost it on my watch. What the hell is that thing you keep playing with? It's my stress toy. It showed up in the mail a few weeks after we got to Australia. All right, we better get a move on. We don't want Asav to get ahead of us. You know, I've had my fair share of screw-ups. <laughs> you just pick yourself up and move on. I don't like it, No one does, love. <laughs> right. All right, let's find a way out. Last one back to the car buys dinner. I brought him Maurice. You're no fun. Figures. We shall see. Hello! Brothers, where are you? You see? Do a sweep! Ross and Fraser might still be here. Come on, show yourself! <laughs> Cut one down over here! Look around, people! Watch it! Another one down! Come out, asshole!
We're clear. For real this time. You handled yourself on. All things considered. What things are those? No real combat training. Ah. Slightly impulsive. Run around the field like a maniac. Need to learn what short, controlled burst means. All right. And lost. Wearing red in a jungle combat scenario. I mean, seriously. anywhere else out there. Now's the time to do it. Right. Look, for what it's worth, your kick-ass reputation. We've got you this job. Plus, I figured you could use the money. You're not wrong. Honestly, though, it's actually nice working with a woman for a change. <laughs> do rot. Not many of us out here. This one arm stealer demanded to speak to the man in charge, then tried backing out when I informed him I was running the show. Uh, what did you do? Broke both his legs. <laughs> You're not kidding. Just trying to level the playing field. Oh, don't cross Ross. <laughs> I should put that one on my business card. Can't you just walk away, be done with Shoreline? I was born in Tuts. I don't have a choice. Oh, there's always a choice. Get bored and leave. Probably won't unless we ask them. I'm just going to take a look around. Yeah, I'll keep an eye out. Thank you for your indulgence.
Here we go. Coming. Right behind you. Magnificent. How long do you suppose it takes to carve something like this? Years. Decades, even. The Hoi Sala certainly did have a knack for stonework. And the war, it seems. That too. They must have made these to commemorate their victories against the Persians. Looks like they put up a good fight. They did. Pity it didn't last. But their loss is our gain, right? That carving looks familiar. That carving is an exact match for the disc. So what does that mean? I don't know yet. But I'm guessing we should give that a try. Should we dance? Try not to break at this time. Sassy. <laughs> You ready? Yeah. Just, um, taking it all in.